So how does binary work? Well, firstly, binary is a number system. Bi meaning two, like a bicycle or bifocals, two lenses over here. Bi means two. And the two numbers that are in the binary number system are a one or a zero, and that's as high as it can go. So the numbers are represented by one, zero, 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 one, two, one, zero, one, 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 zero, zero, or 100, 101, 110, and so on goes all the way up to eight over here where this is one zero zero zero. So how does this number system actually work? Well, the place values are a bit different than the place values that you're used to looking at. So you're probably used to decimal system, dec meaning 10 and decade, 10 years, decagon, 10 sides. That means that your number system has a total of 10 digits, zero, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. And with the decimal number system, we can use place values, place values that you're probably used to. So we have over here, you're used to the ones place, the tens place, the hundreds place, the thousands place, and the ten thousands place. So this number over here, you'd recognize as 22,706. But the reason that that number is 22,706 is because of the multiplication, the groupings inside. So what this is really saying is we have, this is the ones place. So we have six groups of one. We have zero groups of 10, seven groups of 100, two groups of 1,000, and two groups of 10,000. So if we have two groups of 10,000, we're at 20,000. Two groups of 1,000, 22,000. Seven groups of 100, 22,700. Zero groups of 10, 22,700. And six groups of one, 22,706. That's how this number came to be in the decimal system. The binary system works the exact same way, where this over here is the base of 10 and the exponent of zero which says we have zero copies of 10. 10 to the zeroth power is always equal to one. We have one copy of 10, which is just 10 times itself one time. Then we have over here 10 to the second, which is 10 times 10 times one, which is two copies of 10 times itself, which is 100. Three copies of 10, which is 10 times 10 times 10 times one, which is 1,000 and so on. So these numbers come from the base 10, zero times one two three which is where the ones tens hundreds thousands place comes in so same over here so the base is 10 the base and the power is how many copies of the base are being multiplied together multiplied together zero times one two three four and five so binary works the exact same way so in this case though instead of a base of 10 we have a base of two by meaning two like bicycle so two to the zero is one, two to the one is two, two to the second is four. We have three copies of two, which is eight, four copies, 16, 32, 64, 128. So in order to do the binary numbers over here, what we have is we can create these using these different light bulbs or these different numbers. So if we wanted to create the number nine in binary, this would be too high, this would be too high, 32 too high, 16 too high, but we'd want the eight place value on too high, too high, and we put the one place value on to create the number nine, which is represented as 0001001. So these ones represents, yes, there it is on, there's electricity. Well, zero means no, no electricity. And this is being represented as this pattern of numbers. So if we were to create another number in this case, if I wanted to create a number such as 18, this one would be too high, too high, too high. We'd want the 16, this one would be too high, too high, we'd want the two, and then we'd create 18, which would be the pattern 0, 0, 0, 1, 0, 0, 1, 0. And we can keep doing this, and we can create whatever number we wanted over here. Let's say we picked 29. So 29 in this case would be 16 plus 8, and then 4, too much. And then we need the 4, no 2, and the 1. That number is 29. So 0, 0, 0, 1, 1, 1, 0, 1. So my guess is try and play this game over here. Turn the labels off. It gets a little harder. Your goal is to try and remember this was the ones place, the twos place, 4, 8, 16, 32, 64, 128. And in total, if we add all these up, we have a total of 255 places, including zero for a 256 place, which is the max number of data that any byte or eight, a group of eight bits can represent 256 things. So play around with the game mode practice trying to create a certain number with binary, but the way that it works, this is base two, two to the zero, two to the first, two to the second, two to the third, two times two times two, three times is eight, two to the fourth, two to the fifth, two to the sixth, two to the seventh, 
and you can create any number between 0 and 255 with these binary numbers. So binary is base 2 by meaning 2. The two numbers are 0 and 1 over here, and we can create 256 total different uh, informational uh, bits and single bit over here is one piece of data. Eight in total makes a byte of information, which is 256 possible things. So this is binary in five minutes. Playing this will definitely help. I'll leave the link in the description so you guys can play this if you want to practice understanding how binary works. And I'll see you guys in the next video.